really need some money. Here it is. Good evening and welcome to the Tuesday, November 12, 2024 meeting of the Martinsville Board of Works and Safety. The meeting is hereby called to order. The clerk, please call the roll. Kelly Bray. Present. John Lillywhite. Present. Mayor Costin. Present. We have a quorum. Thank you. You received a copy of the minutes from the Monday, October 28th meeting in your packets. Are there any additions or corrections or questions? Uh, no. No, I'll make a motion we accept the minutes as written. I will second that motion. Motion made and seconded to approve the minutes as presented. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed no. The motion carries. And a new business, Mr. Oaks. Good evening. You may recall at the last meeting we opened the biz on the salt barn. We had a single bidder, bidder that was Davis County Mill. Uh, we have reviewed that bid, and it's an excellent bid. Uh, they've done two buildings previously to that, and done a good job for us, so we're recommending, recommending tonight uh, Davis County's medals, $76,000. To be more exact, $76,200, but yeah. I don't have any questions about that, Kelly. No. And I would motion that we accept that be or approve that bid and award it to Davis County Metal. Davis County Metal. And I'll second it. And a motion made and seconded to approve the bid from Davies County Metal for seventy-six thousand two hundred dollars for the salt forward of the street department. All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed no. Motion carries. Thank you, Gary. Next, we have the utility easements we talked about last time. I believe there's three of them here. Mr. Coffey, do you want to walk us through, and do we have to vote on each one separately? Uh, we should uh, vote on each one separate, just because of the different sections. These are easements that the uh, Duke Energy is requiring in order to be able to power our pumps uh, for the levy. Okay. And this is the north levy, the existing levy. Uh, it's 10 feet in width, and uh, as you saw from your packets, it has both a legal description and a drawing depicting where the easement area is. And so there's three different segments, um, and uh, we can identify them, I guess, by their um, length, uh, or actually area. Uh, the first one looks like it's 0 .049 of an acre, so it's a, a very short one. The second one is 0 .457 of an acre, and the third one is 0 .437 of an acre. Any questions for Mr. Coffin regarding these easements? No. No. Okay. Let's just go ahead and walk through and take each one individually then. I would motion that we approve the uh, easement agreement ending in 023. 
Or the point four nine, I guess. Is that the first one? Yes. Yes. I'll second it. Motion made and seconded to approve the easement ending in zero two three, which is is it point zero four nine or point four nine? It's point zero four nine. Point zero four nine. All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed no. Motion carries. I'm sorry, I'm looking at the uh, parcel number and not the easement. Yeah. Uh, then I would make a motion that we approve the second easement listed ending in 020. Uh, I think that's 0.457 acres. Yes, I'll second it. And a motion made and seconded to approve the second utility easement and in 020, which is 0.457 of an acre. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed none. Motion carries. Uh, and I will motion that we approve the third easement listed ending in 021.437 acres. I'll second that. Motion made and seconded to approve the final utility easement for Duke Energy, ending in 021, which is 0.437 of an acre. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? No. Motion carries. Maybe to clarify for you what you just did, <laughs> uh, we have four pump stations that run the length of the north levee and connect to the south levee just past the bridge. Uh, this is Duke running the power line down through properties we've acquired, and their power line, we don't have a final number for this, but it's expensive. We'll be, we'll be surprised to be $150,000, but it's a long run, and it's to release power stations. Each of, these, each of these pump stations also have an emergency generator, so no more frequently than they come on to handle a flood, they'll come on monthly just to make change for maintenance. Thank you, Gary. Uh, there are no SEER adjustments tonight. And the next regular meeting of the Board of Works and Safety will be on Monday, November 25th, 2024, 6.30 here in the Council Chambers. If there's no other business, we are adjourned. Fabulous.